Hey guys, it's City Tutorials here, and uh, I just wanted to let you guys know uh, I do apologize for not having a video up for a while. I was on a little vacation, and now I am back. I know I didn't have much coverage on the new iPods and the Apple TV and iTunes 10 and everything, uh, but uh, if I had done that, I'm sure you guys would have already gotten an overflooded uh, subscription box with ads and all sorts of things that nobody really likes because I know I did. Um, so I just wanted to put out a quick video today maybe one coming up tomorrow um, but on this video I'm gonna be showing you guys two really cool tweaks um, and if you're really smart you'll be able to actually identify one of them right off the bat um, this one's called gridlock and basically what gridlock allows you to do is rearrange your icons in any sort of sh whoa any sort of way you want to uh, put them at so let's say I want to put uh, this icon over here and there you go. Normally, let's say YouTube would have to move all the way over here, but with Gridlock, you can rearrange your icons in any sort of way, as you guys can see, like here. Or if you want to, you know, show something in the background, you can also put it as in this way. And this works perfectly fine with all devices, including the iPad. So it's a really nice feature that you can use to rearrange your icons, especially if you're a theme maker or anything of that sort. Uh, it's a very handy application. Um, and you can also always uninstall it whenever you don't feel like using it inside of Cydia. Um, so that one is called Gridlock. So the second uh, cool little tweak that uh, you guys can get now on Cydia is called YourTube 2. And this is actually integrated straight inside of the YouTube application itself, so you won't have to have any new apps or anything downloaded onto your iPod. Um, off, off the bat here, you guys can see that I have a download tab in the more section. Um, I'm going to sh first show you guys a video to find. I'll just search for one of my videos. Um, so once you find a video that you actually want to download onto your device, you can just click on it, actually click on the blue arrow on the right, and you're going to want to find the download video section or uh, tap button as you guys can see, and here it'll ask you if you would like to download in high quality or low quality or in 720p or in 1080p depending on how the video was actually uploaded to. So if the video has 1080p quality, then you'll be actually able to download it to 1080p on your device, which won't really look as crisp on a small uh, screen, but on the iPad it will look very good. So so um, I'll just download this video in high quality and then it'll start downloading inside the download section and you can look at it straight from there. Most videos won't really take that long to download. Some of them in the higher quality should take a little longer, but all depending on your Wi-Fi uh, connection, it's you know pretty fast or pretty slow. Um, so once this finishes downloading, I'll be right back. So the video has finished downloading and you have one more option after this and this is to uh, add the video to your iPod library or the, your video library. So let's say I uh, I don't really want this video on my iPod library but I have added this one already to it. So I'll show you guys uh, my videos and it'll, you'll be able to see the first video that I have downloaded right there. Um, it's the uh, Love the Way You Lie music video by Eminem. Now, um, one uh, downside to this is that some videos uh, including this one say that it's actually uh, formatted in the wrong way so you might get that uh, message sometimes depending on what kind of video you're actually trying to uh, download and watch so I'm not really sure how that works or if you can get around that in any way or shape or form but uh, most of them should be able to work just fine uh, there you guys can see there's my video right there so um, that's about it guys for this video uh, both of the application names will be inside of the description so you can just search for both of them in Cydia. Uh, they are both paid. Uh, the YourTube 2 is uh, 4 dollars and uh, Gridlock is $0.99. Cents. Uh, so you will have to be paying some money. I'm sure you could probably find a uh, uh, XLI source that may also have them as well or maybe a sinful iPhone repo. I'm not quite sure, but you guys can search for that if you'd like. So um, that's about it, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed the video, and if you could please like, I'd also appreciate that. And uh, yeah, guys, that's about it, and I'll see you in the next video.